What's going on, YouTube? Three Sons RC, come back at you with a bash video. We got the Armor Crate in 6S, Armor Crate in 8S. Both these rigs are completely M2 CFI. Stay to the end of the video. We'll go through all the electronics and all the upgrades in both of these rigs. Today, we got some crazy sends, some crazy stunts, and probably our most tragic ending to the Armor Crate in 8S. Definitely the most expensive crash I've ever had. Make sure you stay to the end to check that out. Today, we're going to be testing out these Method RC Geoformers. Now, guys, if you're looking for a belted action, that's kind of more along the line of like a Proline Badlands. These are some thick knobbies, really tough. Gonna give a lot more grip. Now, they have a couple different options out there. They got the Terraformers and the Geoformers. They're both in this video, and I'll label them for you so you know what's going on. But these definitely got a lot more bite. Guys, check out these knobbies. These are really gonna grab a lot of traction in all different surfaces. Method RC also sends out these tires. In the Armor Crate 6S, we're running the CNHL Pack 4,000 milliamp hours. Guys, I like to keep my batteries a little bit lighter. Lighter, less brakes, guys, and all. And in the Armor Crate 8 we're running this new battery pack that CNHL sent out. This thing is a beast. This has got 9,000 milliamp hours. Now, you know I just said that I like my battery packs light, right, guys? Well, this one actually has about the same weight as a lot of my 6600 milliamp hour guys, but this one's 120C. 9,000 milliamp hours, guys, so you're gonna have a lot of run time and you're not sacrificing on the weight, so you're gonna have less brakes. So check these out. Link in the description for discounts on CNF Jeff packs. But, guys, I've been yapping entirely too much. Let's get to the bash. Guys, enjoy. This might end up really bad. If you had one shot, one opportunity, would you capture it? <laughs> uh, now I gotta get her out. I pretty nice triple with the crate. <laughs> that's about, it's hard to tell, but that's about like, it's about like 15, 20 feet down. Got some Method RC Geoforms on there, baby. She's a rocket. Yeah, I think she got way more grip in the grass, that's for sure. I need more steering. But, Good for ramping it up, and that's what I want to do. She gets up and go, baby. 1280 kV motor. I mean, she's still trying to wheelie. Not so clean. Oh, that was far from clean. There's the ramp. <laughs> Triple, baby. Got plenty of pow pow to do a triple. Oh! That was a bad miscalculation. And she's just M2C tough on that. I don't understand. The worst of the worst landing. A little wobbly, nothing crazy. All right, old guy. Let's see if you can climb the fence like you did when you were a kid. All right. 
It's a lot of effort to get her back. But right on the RPM bumper. You know, not as young as I used to be. It's a little bit harder than it used to, than I used to remember. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> King Crane, baby. <laughs> Uh, M2C5 piece, this thing. Oh, the king, the original king. Not the big king. Big king's great now, yes. But this thing's nuts. <laughs> Do me proud, baby. Do me proud. Probably don't have much more juice in there. Maybe enough for like two more hits. Let's see if I can get full pin on her. Oh, LBC. Wasn't two more hits, it was one more hit. Two. Whoa. Barely. Oh. oh! Oh! I've never seen that before. It's the impact, bro. I've never seen a Max 5 explode. Oh! Dang! It's still running. Oh no, your fan's on a different battery. It's just... No, the fan's off the ESC. Oh, there it goes. Holy crap. I've never seen that before. Oh, look at that capacitor. Oh, the capacitor's done. Damn. That yeah. worked. Yeah. Damn, that was an expensive Ooh. jump right there. I've never seen that. No. That's a new one. One on one, not crazy, uh, but it was more vertical. Uh, but one on one is pretty respectable um, out there. Uh, but it was, she, she was up there. She was up there. I have no idea how much it is up there. Probably about the same, maybe a little bit less because she was more vertical because of the angle of this. This is about like seven feet, right? And then the ramps on top of that make it about eight. 
Uh, I might be exaggerating a little bit. I've been known to do that, so think what you will. But it is what it is. So we're doing pretty well with these discount ramps. Now let's go have some more fun. Crank 6S, M2 CFI, did me proud. She's got a firmer 160 in there and the old Creighton uh, 1250 KV, I believe, uh, from the Outcast 8S. But I run it on 6S with the CNHL 4,000 milliamp hour packs, M2 CFI front to back, hinge pins, towers, braces, tower support brace, chassis, HR bulkheads. Got the bow springs on here for the back, the blue ones. And these are rear Creighton springs in the front for just a little bit more with the bladderless. And also, of course, Method RC tires, because uh, they are just super and fantastic. Appreciate y'all. Like, comment, subscribe. Three Sons RC. Peace out.